Here's the hook. All right. Yes! That's All great. Right. Standing old. One was taller than the other. Oh, Kevin. Yeah. Quite a bit taller than De'Aaron Fox. Kevin Herter in the lane. Gets off a quick one down there on the low block. 17-year drought the Kings have had from the playoffs. It's the longest for any North American professional sports team. Blazers in the zone now. Uh-oh, they forgot to cover the man that was bringing the ball in bounds. It was De'Aaron Fox who just got in bounds and stood there. They won that game at home, and they knew their crowd was, it was a playoff atmosphere. They had people outside of the arena waiting to celebrate, and they didn't get it done there. So I don't think anything in this game. As he chops up the steps, he has to really power off that last leg. It reminds me of, as Herder gets a two, a layup Shaden had against Oklahoma City when he sidestepped a defender. Murray clears the Ubank screen, or the Ubank's hook shot, so bonus. Again finds Herder moving well without the body, without the uh, basketball. With his 10.6 boards, they're within nine with 3.58 to go in the second. What you were just explaining right there about Sacramento's offense, there's a lot of uh, contingencies. Uh, but Sacramento not putting the Blazers in that full court pressure situation at all. They have not bothered the Blazers much. Five turnovers as a team for the Blazers in the first half. Especially if it's a guard back that's smaller than him to really bother him in that situation. Coach Phillips wondering how in the world yeah, the is that not called? The season. Clippers have won tonight. Phoenix is down to Minnesota. Herder with a nice cut and a great time drop. And of course, being the focal point of the opposition's defense. Sabonis turns and twists when he gets in that low. It's over. Driving into the lane is Knox. That one is off. The rebound recovered by Herder. Up the box into the lane to the glass and laid it in. That's a good ball, Frank.